Hello everyone, this is ENG302 Unified Track and we'll focus today on Unit 11, Cultures. Lesson 11.1, .1, Defining Cultures. So by the end of the lesson, you'll be able to, number one, define the word culture. Number two, extend your range of vocabulary related to defining cultures. So before you start solving this exercise, we'll focus on the meaning of culture. So the word culture has a number of definitions, but it refers to everything that makes up the identity of a particular group of people, society, or nation. Now, this exercise, you should fill in the blanks with words from the box to formulate an understanding of culture. You have six words in the box, practice, foods, wonderful, means, family, and beliefs. So I'll give you two minutes, try to fill in the blanks with the words that are suitable, and then we'll read the paragraph together. Check your answers. Read, we read the, uh, the paragraph together. You may have heard the word culture before, but do you know what it actually means? Think about what makes you and your family special. What language do you speak? What traditions and beliefs do you have? Do you enjoy special foods and wear clothing to represent your family or history? The culture of a group of people is the traditions and beliefs that they have practiced in their daily lives. The fact that there are different cultures found throughout the globe is what makes our, our world so wonderful. Here is another question. Choose the appropriate heading for each section from the box. So you have six definitions. I want you to match them or choose the appropriate heading that matches the uh, definition itself. You have two minutes.
check your answers. So number seven will take religion, which is particular faith belief systems within a particular tradition. Eight rules of behavior, which refers to people's unspoken and unwritten ways of doing things like rules of etiquette and manners regarding, for example, how to eat, socialize, drive and dress, etc. Nine traditions specific, for example, specifically uh, national and public holidays, feast days, festivals and its activities. Ten life rituals which covers or refers to birth, marriage, employment, re retirement and how these are treated. Eleven institutions, the political system and the legal educational system as well. Last point or last definition, architecture, characteristic style of buildings and interior design. Okay, now it's time for reading. We'll, we'll read together this paragraph and then you have to answer the question above. When I'm outside Bahrain traveling for my job, I miss the smell of strong Arabic coffee and the smell of the food. I really miss our typical Bahraini breakfast of bread, eggs, beans and tomatoes. I think also of the sunshine in my hometown and holidays where my family and relatives come together. I miss the prayers we have five times a day from the mosques. I also think Bahraini hospitality is wonderful. I miss visiting friends, relatives and neighbors and the way that Bahraini people really ha try hard to make their guests feel comfortable. Another thing I miss about Bahraini culture is the respect for older people. Now, I want you to answer the question above. What does Noor miss about her country, Bahrain? You have only one minute. Yes, let's check your answers. So Noor misses the smell of coffee and food, sunshine in hometown, family holidays, sound of prayers in the mosques, Bahraini hospitality and respect for older people. Okay, here we come to the last slide in our lesson today which focuses on the ideas or concepts related to culture. So you should fill in the flow chart with the words related to culture. For example, language. I want you to think of seven more words related to culture. You have only two minutes.
Yes, let's check together. So as we said before, there are many words related to the word culture, many ideas. So you have values, traditions, life rituals like birth, retirement and etc. Architecture, geography, arts and cuisine. So here we come to the end of the lesson. I hope that the lesson was clear and interesting to you. Thank you so much.